Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. I'm going to show you today how to delete all of your Facebook posts on your Facebook page all at once. So first things first, I'm gonna show you on my iPhone on the Facebook app and then we'll hop over to my computer and I'll show you how to do it on desktop. So here we are on my iPhone in the Facebook app. You need to make sure that you're acting as the Facebook page that you want to delete the post from. So in order to do that, tap the menu button in the lower right hand corner or the lower bar there of the app and then go to where you see your page. You'll see your shortcuts with your different pages there. Uh, there's a little circle around it, but if you hit the down arrow here, you should be able to see all of the different pages that you have access to as an admin. So go ahead and tap into the one you wanna switch to. Once we're here, we just wanna tap on it at the very top there, tap on the Facebook page, and it'll take you to that Facebook page itself. Once you're here, you want to scroll down to where you see posts about videos, the normal stuff here on Facebook. Make sure you have posts selected, and then you'll see something below that that says manage posts. Tap into manage posts. Now, you'll see a scheduled published and group post tab at the top. You need to tap on publish, which will be in the middle or towards the left, and then you'll see the published post, all of them. And again, you can always delete all of them at once. So what we want to do now, and by the way, if you want to delete them individually or as a, as a group, you just tap into the boxes here and then you delete the ones that you select. But we're going to go ahead and go to select all. That's going to select all of our posts here that we've posted. And just remember, if you have a bunch of posts, you may need to scroll down to have them you know, show up. So make sure you're showing all of your posts. Now, when we go up here and we select all, you can see it's going to be 19. So go ahead and load all of your posts, select them all by going to select all, and then just tap the edit button there. And then you're going to see an option to move to trash or hide from profile. Now, if you want to permanently delete these posts, I would move them to the trash and they'll be permanently deleted after a 30 day period. If you only want to hide them, say temporarily, uh, or appear in other places like shares and things like that, you can go to hide from profile, but I would tap on to move to trash and it'll be deleted within 30 days from the trash, but it will be completely removed from Facebook publicly right now as you delete that and move those to the trash. So that's how you do it on the app. Now I'm going to show you over on desktop. All right, here we are on desktop and I have my Facebook page pulled up. Make sure you are acting as the Facebook page and not your personal profile. And then once we are here, you're going to go ahead and click into the posts tab, which is right up here where you normally would type things in. And then you go down to uh, the little bottom area here and you should see something that says manage posts right next to filters. Go ahead and click on manage posts. Now, as you can see, there is going to be a list of all of our posts. Now, remember, uh, it may load depending on how many posts you have, and it has them kind of sorted by month. Uh, so what you would want to do is go to, you know, basically select all right here where you see the different months, and then every post for that month will be selected. Now, it'll show you down here in the blue text how many posts you have selected currently out of how many, and then what you would do is you would go ahead and click next, and then you can either hide or delete them, for this purposes of the video, we'll go to delete and then go ahead and click done. Remember, when you delete the post, they will go directly to the trash can. Within 30 days, they will be completely deleted and you'll never be able to get them back. So hiding a post is the best option if you think at one point you may want to go back and revive those old posts. But that's it. That's how you delete posts all at once on a Facebook page. If you have any questions, please put those in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if this video helped you out. And I'll see you guys in the next video.